Welcome to Baxter's Weekly Yoga Balance Pose. If you're enjoying these balance poses that I've been sharing with you every week, I want to make sure that you know about longer programs that you can enjoy as well on the website YogaU, as in the university, yogauonline.com. I have a whole series of practices that range from 30 to 75 minutes long on a whole variety of topics that I know you're going to enjoy. So please check that out if you haven't done so, so far. They have a nice subscription for that, and it's a great home practice channel for you to start uh, exploring. So today, uh, I want to remind you that a couple months ago, I shared with you something called Dynamic Eagle Pose. And this Dynamic Eagle Pose was kind of a very quick one, in and out of Eagle Pose with the breath. And today's version, I'm calling kind of the slow, move, the slow food movement version of Dynamic Eagle. And we're going to go in and out much more slowly, and sometimes slowing down will create its own new interesting challenges. So let me show this to you. What I'd like you to do is bring your feet a little bit closer together, so the feet are about, uh, uh, almost touching. And then we're going to go through this slowly the first time so you can get a sense of it. So on an inhale, bring your arms up and out to your sides. As you exhale, bend your knees straight forward and shift your weight onto your right foot. As you inhale, lift your left leg up in the air so the toes clear the floor. And as you exhale, cross the legs and sit down more completely so the big toe touches the floor. As you inhale, cross the arms, and as you exhale, bring the arms up in the eagle position. On your next inhale, the arms come out to the side, and then as you exhale, release and come down. You'll notice that my big toe stayed on the floor, so that does help your balance a little bit, but because of the pace of going in and out, it's a little slower, it can be a little more challenging, especially for the hips, and you want to keep the hips nice and even. Let's try it on the second side. Inhaling, the arms come up. Exhale, the knees bend and you shift your weight onto your left foot. Inhale, lift the right leg up in the air without straightening the left. Exhale, sit down a little more completely so the big toe touches the floor if you can. Inhale, your arms cross, left arm on top. Exhale, hands bind. Uh -huh. You're gonna inhale, opening the arms, and then as you exhale, uncross the legs and release your arms down. Let's try it a couple times in real time. Inhale, arms go up. Exhale, bend the knees forward, shift. Inhale, lift the leg. Exhale, sitting down into the pose, both legs are bent. Inhale, crossing. Exhale, binding. Inhale, opening. Exhale, releasing. And to the left side. Inhaling, arms come out. Exhale, bend the knees forward, shift your weight onto your left foot. Inhale, lift the right leg up. Exhale, cross and sit. So you're down a little further. Inhale, left arm on top. Exhale, bind, inhale, open up, and then exhale, release. Now, I'm going to do it with you without actually giving you a lot of instruction. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Let's do it again on the second side. Inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale. Once without any verbal instruction together. Second side. And if you were watching closely on that last time through, you'll notice that I accidentally bent my knees as my arms came up. So I brushed that a little bit. And that can be the tendency if you're not really grounded and clear and focused. So, Take your time playing around with this. This is the slow version of dynamic eagle pose. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, I'm here at the Oakland Yoga uh, School, the o Oakland Yoga Studio in Oakland, California. If you're in town, come take class with me and one of the other teachers here. Uh, follow me on BaxterBell.com, uh, also on Yoga for Healthy Aging. You can like my Facebook page, Baxter Bell Yoga. And of course, I'm on YouTube at Baxter Bell Yoga as well. Don't forget the Yogi You Online videos. Check them out. There's some free content on YouTube so you can get a sense of the videography and have the really nice quality of those, of those programs. Until next time.
Namaste.